Guys, it's Dane with DynastyBreaks.com. It's the 11th of April, 2021. We're bu busting six boxes of Allen & Ginner baseball uh, from Topps. Uh, this is a half case. We let you guys draft your teams in this one. We just had a little fantasy draft, and here are the results of that draft. Uh, Bob with the Yankees and Rockies. Josh with the White Sox Royals. Brian with the Angels D-backs. Jalen, non-MLB and the Marlins. Uh, Daniel with the box topper spot. He'll get all box toppers in this break, also with the uh, Cleveland franchise. Dan with the Braves and Tigers. Ryan, Padres Nationals. Eric, Dodgers Rays. Jay Lynn, Red Sox Twins. Craig, Mariners Orioles. Ryan with the Astros A's. Craig with the Blue Jays and Rangers. Matthew J, Brewers Giants. Robert, Haya, Reds and Cardinals. Chad from Hanson with the Mets and Cubs. And Dylan with the Phillies and Pirates. Uh, here are the details about shipping in this break. This is a very base-heavy product, guys. Uh, you'll get all autographs, you'll get all relics, you'll get all mini cards, and you'll get all serial numbered cards for the teams you have in the random or in the draft. Excuse me. Uh, all non-MLB cards will go to the non-MLB spot that are above noted above. Uh, all box toppers will go to the box topper spot. Doesn't matter what team it's for. Uh, and then base cards and regular inserts, we don't sort them. We give everyone one stack of base, and it'll be all different teams or possibly some base cards of uh, non-MLB stuff. Uh, the rest of the base cards that we're not able to ship, uh, usually it's like maybe 30 to 40 percent. Uh, we donate those to kids, guys. So kids organizations here in town. We got a box topper rip card last time, and it was awesome, and we ripped it live on the air. We will do that for you if you ask us to do a rip card, but you don't have to. We'll ship it to you as well. Oh, I love these. I do, I'm do. i not as big of a fan of the big box toppers. I like the little uh, N43, smaller ones. We have actually gotten a Juan Soto autograph in one of these before. So here you go, box topper spot, Daniel. This will be your first box topper. Acuna, very nice. Ronald Acuna. I'm gonna sit these off to the side. Put those all together. Ronald Acuna. Guys, if you're watching this break, uh, it is a pretty long break to watch. We're gonna do a hit recap at the end. So you can fast forward your video if you just want to see the uh, relic cards, the autos, all the big hits. We'll do that at the end. Uh, I'll wave my block here in front of the camera so you can, when you're fast forwarding, you can see that we're doing the hits. But you're welcome to watch the whole break. It's fun. George is going to do sounds. Mm. We're going uh, pack by pack on this one. It's easier to get the minis. Mm. This is a longer break. We have plenty of breaks tomorrow, Monday night, so check out our website, DynastyBreaks.com. All right, where monsters live. A cave, George. Ooh. <laughs> that was the first sound. Ooh. It's actually purple, Carly. I sat in some grape juice when I came up here. J.K. Dobbins, my guy. Not. Uh, Victor Robles. I'm going to check the back on all these. That's an Allen & Ginner back, a little more rare. You may have a hand-numbered back on some of these. Let's get a fossil. I hear people getting these fossil relics and all this yeah. stuff. Uh-oh. And what are you worried about? Goose Gossage. Talk to me, Goose. And uh, talk to me, George. The oh. cow! Oh! oh. Jeez, that was before it was even prompted. <laughs> you were ready. <laughs> That's what most of the ladies tell me, Carly. All right, uh, Shun Yamaguchi. Mini. Pyrite. Arg. Mad cow disease. All right, we need ratings on the Georgia Sounds. Oh, you rate me on flipping cards over out of a box. Let's get some ratings here. Mm. Ratings. He needs to know how he's doing. He needs people need feedback. 
People need feedback to feel good about what they're doing, George. Bauer for the Reds. Allen and back. Wilshire Grand Center. Haven't been there in a long time. Probably George. Kyle Lewis, rookie. Ty Cobb. Uh, this is a parallel. La Stella. Stella. We have an 8.3 on the cow from Brian. Wow. Pretty high. Yeah. 8.3. I feel good about that. It's like getting an 83 on a test. Wow. All right, we have a ladybird beetle bugging out. And I'm going to, before you say your sound, George, you don't see that many bugging out in this. You see more of it in Allen Ginner Chrome. Yeah. I don't, I don't know on the, the... I'm bugging out, I'm bugging out, I'm bugging out. <laughs> Rate that. <laughs> what, you, Rate you that piece of. Have up. you ever heard a, what, uh, what are those called? June, that's not a June. What are, what are those called? Ah. Oh, we got a rip card. Oh. Rod Carew. Nice rod. There you go. Angels. Brian EHA starting out with a rip card. There will be a mini inside of this. That is number 34 of 75. Rod Carew. And it could be any of these things inside. You're hoping for that top red mini auto. Minus two. This kid. Well, you you guys tell me what a ladybug sounds like. All right, rip card. That is a hit, George. So put that in the hit pile. And you will have the option to rip that live, Brian, or not. It's up to you. If you do rip it, no guarantee of the condition of the outside card. Very cool, man. Congrats. Luis Robert, base rookie card. Random stacks on that. Citadels and safe holds. Balmoral Castle. Let's learn about this since we're not in a hurry tonight. Uh, since Prince Albert was in a can, um, there's a big estate there. Learned about that. Did you guys actually want me to read that? I thought about it. Uh, Pence, Hunter Pence. None the richer. Prince Albert in a can. She's a nice lady. What does she do anyway? Is she a reality star? Comedian and professional foosball player. There you go. Foosball. Foosball's the devil. Um, Jim Abbott. Old school. Alan again are back. If no trout, we can rip at the end. So if there is a trout, we won't. Okay, the garden says... Hmm. I thought these plants got taller than this. <laughs> okay. I thought, I thought That's the, a one. Yeah, that's... That is, a, that is a one. We had a 1.2 on the last. I'm going to be interested in We had the, a negative two on the uh, last also. Oh, my gosh. George Brett, nice uh, mini card there for the Royals. Oh, hand-numbered mini. I thought this might be a different picture. Did not recognize this one. Very cool. That is counting as a hit for the Royals, George. Second to last team. Nobody wanted the Royals in this draft. George Brett, baby. Huge card. 5 of 25. Commemorating the uh, 1887 original Allen & Ginner set. You realize that if you guys oh, are, are so positive, cool. you get better results. Ah, steal with the Royals. The more negative I get, the less I want to do. What a steal. That's a great card, man. That's just human nature. This is a great box. Hand numbered mini and a rip card. I'm, I'm not thinking so. If you got a personal box of this, that's exactly what you want to be getting. We still have one hit left, I think. Negative 100 on your garden rating. That's pretty bad, George. 
Got to redeem yourself here. Juan Soto parallel. He looks really angry. Now he he uh, listened to George's last impression. All right, the horse says. Me, me. Oh. Right that. Uh, I don't know if the mini counts as one of the three. That's a good question. So we may have two, two more. Donaldson for the Twins. Allen and Ginner back. Uh, Jade. Looks like Kryptonite. Seven. And a 7.5. We have an oh my rating. <laughs> Carly's all about your jokes. <laughs> Robin Yount. Speaking of Carly, Carly uh, likes to stalk Robin Yount in his parking lot home. Well, can I just leave out the uh, comments for the... Uh... Nine of ten. Wow. Thank you. Mint Thank condition. You. Yeah. Yelich got a little uh, bent corner there on that one. And we have an Austin Meadows bat relic. Going to the Rays. Tampa Bay. Rays up. Tampa Bay is going to be Eric over in Facebook. Ah, <laughs> uh, Robin left you. All right. Baseball writer here going to the non MLB spot on the mini. We don't have those sounds, but we will someday. Vogelbach for the Mariners. Uh, Painite, the official uh, mineral of George. Painite. First bat relic for Eric. Yeah. Here you go, man. All right, Joey Gallo, Rangers, parallel mini. Now, if we do happen to get a hot box, those base cards will sort. We'll, uh, those all ship. We've, we've got a hot box the last couple of uh, breaks, and all the cards are foil. If that happens, then all the base cards on those will ship. Just FYI. Crack the code. Those things are a dime a dozen. You guys can just pause the video here if you want to. Pretty sure this is expired now, but uh, Uriel you can rewind and read that if you wish. Oh, you left him. Yeah, it's not what he said. All right, we've got the very rare leopard mini. <laughs> I don't know. That's some mucus there. <laughs> Ooh, speaking of mucus, what is that? Ooh, that's not from me. Ooh. 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 It's a, Ooh. It's a rubber band. Ooh. I'm serious. That was a rubber band. That's very strange. Yeah, you know, it's really hard to find free sound. What do we call it? That's part effects. of a rubber band, man. So. Yeah, that was really bad. I don't know how to do a... Booger relic. Cats. Hello. Where monsters live. A dark tunnel. I've got one of those at home, Grandpa. No, I really don't, unfortunately. All right, we've got Moncada for the White Sox and Allen and Ginner back. We've got down on the farm, the combine goes. Uh, what are we cutting this time? <laughs> wow, it's a talking combine. Well, what else is it going to say? It makes a noise. No, it doesn't make a noise. Oh, it's totally quiet, cutting it's, down the field. Yes, it's an electric combine. All right, we've got the Baseball Brit, the Baseball Brit uh, Relic card, game used, or what is it, subject used memorabilia, going to the non-MLB spot. British baseball fan. Well, that was unusual. I didn't... Yeah, you did the... Uh, I did the letters. Letter, yeah. Juan Marichal. Garnet. There we go.
I know, I'm trying to get George to break the next Allen & Ginner and I'll do the sounds and top load. All right, oversized box loader this time. Yeah, I don't think he'll do it. Oh, I will. If I'm over there, I will. Yeah. But you would have to break baseball. You could do it right now. You could do it from where you are. You could Clayton, just fill in every other time. Clayton Kershaw. Clayton Kershaw for the box topper spot. Stand by. Laundry tag. Baseball Brit. All right, here we go. That was a great box one, by the way. Mm. Where just... monsters live. See, I do that. A sewer drain. That's great. You say the same thing every time. How joy Change it smells. up like ch change it up like every time you get. Okay, I will. Okay. Well, it, probably the next Allen and Ginner, John Rob. <laughs> All right, we've got Brandon Lau for the Rays. Allen Ginner back. And we've got a Trammel, Alan Trammel, my guy, Detroit. And the barn says, Hey, there's two guys out behind me fighting. <laughs> wow. What? I'll rate that one pretty good. That was crazy. Hey, hey, why are they fighting? Yeah, I don't know, but you know you always, you always hear if it's like, you know, I'm going to take you out behind the barn and kick your butt. I don't ever hear that. Oh, come on. You've heard that saying before. I don't have a barn. Uh, Emmerich going to the non-MLB spot. Red Barrel. Hear people do racing around those. George Brake's playbook. Uh, Andrew Jones. Uh, Manny Machado. Manny? Allen and Ginner back. Uh, you tuned into a nightmare, Mike. You sure did. It's the woodshed, says CSIM, not the barn. Kyle Lewis, rookie mini. There you go, Seattle. All minis do ship to your team. Are there numbered variants? of the non-sport. What do you mean numbered variant? You mean like the parallel minis and stuff? All right, we've got a dragonfly bugging out, George. Classic, nice, like that. Solid dragonfly. Rate that, guys, dragonfly. <laughs> Dragonfly. All right, we got an Almora Jr. for the Cubbies pinstripe jersey patch. There you go, Chicago on the board. That's Chad. Yeah, you got to remind me every time because I'm going to forget. Every time. Chad with the Mets and Cubs. George gave up top loading. He's just Not doing top sounds. Not loading. The, the, uh, it's the Dubon. Solid nine. Uh, on the Dragonfly with a 6-1 from Brian. Pretty rough score there. Yeah. Brian's tough. He's hard. He is. Redeemed yourself from the Combine, says Ricky. All right. Citadels and Safehold. Crack de Chevalier. Let's learn, guys. An important symbol of the Great Crusades. Crack de Chevalier survived numerous medieval attacks. Most notably, a siege by the mighty Saladin in 1188. You remember that? I don't. Oh, okay. Uh, this wonderfully preserved castle was first inhabited by the Kurds in the uh, 11th century. You like cheese curds? Fry some of those I'm up. I'm not sure I do. Hmm. Figured you did. All right. Mini for the non-MLB. Can't say his name. 
I like to we like to educate people in this break too. This is about education. <laughs> All right, George's guy, a little mini wood, mini carry wood, right up your alley, George. Stack these over here. Stand by. Wisconsin staple indeed. Jeez, Kurtz. Ah, the things that happened during this break. All right, Dunst. Non MLB. Is Mr. Chow. All right, Dunst again, parallel. And uh, the ever popular down on the farm, Bale of Hay. Hey, hey, we're the monkeys. I don't. <laughs> oh, you just downgraded yeah, from that last boy. You brought it up and you just destroyed yourself. Oh, that was bad. Oh, that's a bad one. 2.5. Yeah, that's, that's pretty generous. Honus Wagner mini. There you go. Alan Ginnerback, Pirates. Labradorite. Makes an excellent pet or just a rock. That's that's the original pet rock. 1.25. We have a point one. Oh, yeah, you're getting pretty rough on that one. Not a big fan on the bale of hay. Noah Syndergaard, Thor. Mets. Uh, the Comcast Tech Tower. Won't make George do a sound for that. I know what I should have said on the bale of hay. Yeah, oh, there'll be another one. I don't know if there will be. And we have a frame. We have a hit. Hope it's an auto. It's framed. It's a mini. It is a relic card. Looks like Paul Goldschmidt, Goldilocks Bat Relic Mini Framed Card. There you go, Cardinals. St. Louis. Robert. Robert Haya, Dane is Fire, of Dane is Fire fame. Very nice. All right, Sano. There'll be another bale of hay, George. Don't worry. Lou Gehrig. Mo Vaughn. And we got a Tommy Edmond for the Cardinals. Allen and Ginner back. And the chicken goes. Is that a chicken or a rooster? Well, it says chicken. Look. Well, roosters are chickens, too. No, they're yeah. roosters. Okay. Um. <laughs> It's not. Do you do a pig at the end? There's a pig chasing the, the chicken. Oh, you're trying to do extra on this one to make up for the last abomination. Well, like this, is, this is a pretty big abomination. Mike Trout base. Alex Rodriguez looking happy. Yeah, LCD, you can't say that because you can't say anything because that's what I was going to use. Quartz. Quartz. Uh, El Ray with the good lord comment. It's too hard to think of these things on the Not a pig, George. Yeah. Whatever. Alright, Joe Torrey for the Cardinals. Parallel. Mini. Pig hot for the chicken. <laughs> Seamus just won us the title. The snorting chicken. <laughs> there you go. All right, we've got the rare gazelle mini. I got nothing. Didn't she marry to Tom Brady? Probably, yeah. Come well, on, yeah. You, you I can't wonder where on. Tom is. He stole my idea. No, see he, now he, he's he, given up. We're in box freaking two. He's not yeah, doing this now. It's not easy to do this. Just a gazelle, just whatever that comes yeah, to your mind. Yeah. First. I do, the, the thing that came to my mind last time was trying to do a chicken and it ended up like a pig. That's okay. It's entertainment. <laughs> it's not entertainment to me. What do you think a gazelle would do? Um, run. What would they say? Fast. What sound? 
There's no sound. They're faster than sound. So there'd be a sonic boom. <laughs> there'd be a sonic boom. I reset my computer. Uh, where monster? <laughs> oh, I got to do it different. Where monster? No, no, land. you got to say something different. You can't say where monster. You say something about monsters. No, but that's what the card's called. Well, I know what it is. I understand that, but every card I do is different. We have. Well, what do you want me to say? I like there's some whatever you think you want to say about a dark tunnel. See, it's not so easy coming up with things to say. Yeah, but this doesn't. A dark tunnel doesn't say anything. Well, neither does a farm. Yeah, it does. No, it, neither does a tractor. Neither does a combine. They don't say anything. A barn sure doesn't say anything. All right, a dark tunnel says, "If you tosseth a hot dog down a dark tunnel, it shall disappear into the night." There you go. That's great. I'm gonna do wisdom of the yeah. uh, where well, monsters right live. Right, that wisdom. Write that with you. Patrick Wisdom. Oh, you're getting this one. All right, uh, David Dahl. Alan and Ginner back. All right, the silo says. Hey, it's the off season. I'm not being used. Put some water in me and swim around. Do they do that? I don't know. Do they put water in the silos? I don't think so. Carly said gross. All right, we have a patch card. Jose Barrios for the Twins. There you go, Minnesota. Minnesota. It's going to be Jalen. That would be a lot of water. It would be. Uh, Brendan McKay. Brendan McKay. And Sapphire. Now we're getting technical. Sure. Like we have talking barns and talking other Yes. Things. We're going to be technical about well, the I, I'm water. going to take part in the uh, monster comments, but you got to start. You got to start bringing it on the gazelle. Oh, we got the mini box loader. I love it. All right, box topper spot. Here you go, Daniel. I, N43. This is the one on the uh, picture for this product. Bo Bichette, rookie. There you go, nice. Bo Bichette, no auto yet on our box toppers. So there is no off season for a, a silo? No, they're saying the off season is when you do use it. Okay, so on the on season. The on season. Come on, man. Jeez. You're such a whiner. Yeah, well, you do this. I am doing it. You come over and break it, and I'll go over there. I, I'll come over and break it. You guys want that? No. Okay. All right. Um, this is the backside of George, an old trunk. Wisdom, where monsters live. See how that was? That was an old right. trunk. It was, it was really stupid. Where George keeps his extra stuff. This is the backside of George. It's an old trunk. All right, Alex Bregman for the Astros. Alan and Ginner back. You gave that a 7.5? 6.5 for whining. Oh, geez. Weaver, oh, looking like a Philip Seymour Hoffman for the Orioles. All right. <laughs> Whoa, preemptive rooster. Wow. That was a rooster. I'm gonna I'm gonna rate that a nine or above. Wow. Yeah, there's hands coming out of his trunk car. Uh, gross, gross. Got to keep it clean. Milton Bradley Jr. <laughs> Tanzanite, very popular with the kids. Wow, a ten. Wow. BGS pristine, George. There's nowhere else to go but down. To an interrupting moo cow. There's Robin Yount, Carly's neighbor. Um, Mauricio Dubon, a dynasty favorite. Alan and Ginner back. What case is this? Which box is this? Oh, I think it's box one. I don't no, remember. Please tell me it's at least box three. We've got a couple more cases after this. <laughs> All right. J.D. Martinez, Boston, mini. 
Thanks for the solid rating on the rooster. I started it. Uh, All right, Booming Cities of Karachi. Uh, I remember walking through Karachi, George. Nothing but the sand beneath my feet. Man, it's not about Ooh. an hourglass of time. We have a frame. We do. Here we go. Framed card. Frame mini. Autograph. Right. Walker Bueller. Boom. There you go, Dodgers. Nice Bueller. Let's get that off there. Where are the Dodgers? Bueller. There they are. Eric. Very nice card. Nice auto. All right. Contreras for the Cubbies. And this is our longest break, guys. So the last, the last video is actually the longest break we've ever had before at Dynasty. It was an hour and a half. can usually do these in an hour five if I hurry, but I think we've learned on this. We just don't hurry. <laughs> I think I think we, we can hurry if you want to. All right. Oh. Dropping minis. Nine ways to get to first. Hit by the pitch. What happens when somebody gets hit by a pitch, George? Uh, what do they say? Yeah, I can't say it. Can uh, we say it for real? No, just like a sound they would I, make. No. Yeah, I think I'd be like, be, <gasps> oh, something. <gasps> Here's what George would say. Yeah. <laughs> Where? Already one thirteen from official start time. All right, what? He said we're already one thirteen. Oh, we don't count the draft. Yeah, with the draft, it's almost two hours. Tatis, go through the base, and uh, Tony Perez, Hall of Famer, for the Reds. Buster Posey. Oh, you got hit by a line drive. Uh, we were playing baseball. I don't want to be gruesome here. We were playing baseball in uh, Oklahoma when I was, uh, I think I was in high school. My buddy Jeremy, uh, this girl came out to pitch for us. We were practicing. Mm. And he hit a regular baseball directly into her eye socket. Oh, man. It, it cracked her skull. And her entire eye, including the uh, white part, was just bubbling and stuff was running. It was the oh, worst man. thing I've ever seen in my life. Whatever. What happened to her? She's fine. She ended up being okay. As it was, we're all just standing there frozen. It's like, oh, oh we don't know what to do. Call nine one one. All right, a sewer drain. Where uh, this is what happens after the old trunk uh, segment is over. It moves on to the sewer drain segment. At George's house. And the irrigator goes. That was good. That was good. If I if that's all it was, I'd be happy. Oh, you're twelve. Oh, I know the impact point. All right, Francisco Lindor. Cleveland. Allen and Ginner back. Turquoise. Makes a fine piece of jewelry. See, I didn't have to worry about that in baseball because I didn't get to play baseball. So it's probably a good thing. Probably a good thing, Josh. Yeah. All right. Uh, Gwen. That poor girl made a bad decision. That was like behind my house. I, I can't remember where we were. We just had a bunch of people playing. Hmm. I got to ask him about that if he remembers it. Well, I know he remembers it, but. All right, Dakota Hudson. Dakota Hudson, Cardinals. St. Louis, Jersey card. Robert. George has the irrigator down. See, that's one of the more difficult ones, and you're whining about the easy one. Oh, I don't think that's a difficult one. Teft, a guy with skulls, many. 
I can't, if I don't know what the thing's supposed to sound like, it's really hard to come up with a makeup sound. Not that I can always do You don't that. watch like National Geographic or anything? All right, Nick Senzel Mini, Alan Ginner back, and the corn stalks like to talk. Oh, man. Um, what kind of corn are you going to be? Corn on the cob, corn in the can, or popcorn? A cricket sound, anyway. <laughs> All right, Charlie Blackman, Rockies, Ruby. <laughs> two. We have a wow, two. Wow. Chip Gaines. That was corny. That's we got his auto last time. We did. Very short printed card. Uh, Eric Cosmer, Padres, Parallel, One World Trade Center. Still processing that one. That was corny. You know, we, we don't, oh. you know, this, we're not looking for Academy Awards here. Corny, get it, huh? Yeah, I got it. I should have said that. Moises Alou. Alan and Ginner back. That is for the uh, Astros. It was creative. You got a 6 5 for creativity. Oh, yeah. That's not bad. Mm. All right, uh, Josh Bell for the Pirates. See, Terrell, I should have thought of that. You walked in the corn stalks when we went yeah, to Field of Dreams, man. I missed that from last time. I'll have to try to remember that for next time. Where monsters live. Ah. Uh -huh. George just, there's George. He's walking out of this right now. Wow, that's that's great. They're rating me ones and twos. No, you're. that's you. Look at the eyes. That's not me. But Okay, I, the only thing George has inside of this our Oxford shirts, multiple colors, same shirt, mind you, along with Henley shirts, if you know what that is, all different colors. We can show this later on the George cam. That's all that George has. We're educating oh, no. on the monsters. Uh, Kluber, what are you saying? Oh no, I, don't even get I haven't even done the. Card. I haven't even done the card yet. Okay, well I see it. The horse goes. Yeah, it already did. It, it, it's finished. <laughs> the horse is finished. Preemptive horse. I got a seven. Eat that. All right. How do you say his last name? Teft Tattoo Artist Relic. That is a Look. subject used memorabilia. What, they take it off somebody's arm? <laughs> what? Non MLB spot, George. <laughs> non MLB. Oh, gee. Tattoo artist. And then we have a uh, Arcia for the Brewers. And it's gold, Jerry. It's gold. She doesn't care, Cecil. Mm. There were two eyes in there. That was you. Oh, mommy. Whoa, it's a thicky. Oh, mommy. Oh, boy. Box loader spot. You need to start thinking what we're going to do on this. We'll ship this to you sealed. Or this is, to me, this is one of the most desirable things you can get in this product. This is going to be a rip card box loader with three minis inside. Second straight break, we've got one. Oh, mommy dearest. Daniel. Let's see who the subject matter is. Some of these are expensive if it's a good subject on the front. I wonder if it was auto. Do they auto any of these? Oh, oh man. Oh. I don't know how you, I don't know what you do with this card. I, I don't know. What, well, this, share with this is the most expensive uh, large card. It's Mike Trout. Oh my gosh. This is a Mike Trout rip card box loader. Yeah, you can't. I don't. I don't. I don't know what you do. Do they put the best autograph minis in the Mike Trout one? I, I don't know. It's not numbered. 
Who's got that? I feel like the Clemente was numbered we got last time. This is not numbered. So maybe that's the base variety? Daniel has time to check it out. Yeah, check out the values of that on eBay. I'm going to sit that over here. I'm going to sit all your box loaders over here. And see if any of the other ones you see are numbered. Now, don't look if it's been ripped. People still sell them after they're ripped. Don't look at one that's been ripped. Oh, my goodness. Unbelievable box loader. I would not blame you if you just want that in your possession unripped. And uh, just so you know, let's uh, let's show this. Here's the possibilities. Last time we got all three cards were stained glass minis. You can also get a uh, exclusive mini parallel that you can only find in these. You can get a mini wood parallel, mini metal, red mini autograph, which is what you want, or a, a one of a kind sketch. I've actually never seen one of those. And someone told us last time that there was something different about, like, the, the stained glass. This is the only place you can get stained glass. Yeah, I know. But we got three stained glass. Yeah, you can get any of those three. It can be all the same. They could be all autos. They could be no autos. Oh, my gosh. What a hit. Unripped 250? That's it? Oh, that surprises me. I saw a Jeter numbered, uh, I think it was numbered, go for 500. Well, the numbering probably makes it, I would assume. Makes yeah, it. maybe there's a numbered trout. There may be a numbered one. I can't even say anything. A sewer drain is not where that card belongs. 250. Okay, well, that's... At 250, I'm starting to think how much are the minis going to be worth. One for sale is uh, at 400. Listed for 400. All right, Willie Mays. What a great box loader. Allen and Ginner back. Giants. There's one number to 65 as well. Okay. Oh, what a great subject on that one. Mike Trout. All right, Phil Rizzuto for the Yankees. The silo's back, George. Yeah, what the other silo said. Wow. Rate that. Unripped to 99 is 250 as well. So there's one to 99, there's one to 65 is what they're saying in chat. So that is the base version, so to speak. All right, Brendan McKay. Coppa. Not going to get me Coppa. Oh, yeah. If you get an autographed mini of Harrison Ford or something, I mean, it's, that's a lot of money for that. So, the mini red autos are usually numbered to 10. Very hard to get. I think a lot of them. Mookie. And you guys are looking at the box loader. You're not looking at the regular trout rip card. It may have the same picture on it. You're, you're looking at the jumbo box loader with three inside. Make sure you're not looking at the regular rip card. Mariano Rivera. Yankees. Allen and Ginner back. Nice. The 99 is a regular rip card. Okay. That just has one mini inside. Okay, top loader. All right, nine ways to first. Fielder interference. That never happens. How often does that happen? Okay, that was regular, not the box topper for 250. Oh. Right? Is that what you're saying? Uh, that's more like it in my mind. I was thinking five, six hundred, but I, I may be wrong. 
All right, we have a Jeff McNeil for the Mets. Jersey card, there you go, New York. New York Metropolitans. Mm -hmm. Gonna be Chad. Oh, Chad. You go, Mr. Chad. Mini Matt Chapman. Box topper was two fifty. Also, that doesn't even. That's weird. Okay. They're saying they're both around the two fifty three, somewhere in that neighborhood. Sold for 263 on March 10th. Kendrick. Alan Ginner. All right, you get your redemption, George. The Bale of Hay returns. Hey, where is that needle? <laughs> where is that needle? Oh, that's funny. I did it down before, and then OCD stuck it up in chat. Oh, that's funny. Oh, the rare hippopotamus mini. Wow. Woohoohoo. You need a Kleenex? No. Whoa. I don't know what a hippopotamus sounds like. Brian, Probably not that. Brian rated the needle a point zero 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 nine. Wow, well, Steve rated it 10 of 10. So There you go. Tom Seaver, Mets. No, it's just you don't see him that much. We don't see the hippo that much on the mini. I just wanted George to make a sound. Yeah, we have a select tomorrow night, Dark Drips. Uh, check out our website, dynastybreaks.com. Go to our homepage. Got a couple select breaks. Also have some select national treasures listed. I'm going to have uh, regular national treasures listed as well sometime tonight. Uh, Catfish Hunter for the A's. Allen and Ginner back. No, no, it's okay, OCD. You know I'm not mad at you. I'm, I'm just, I'm just uh, lashing out. Cano oh. for the Mets. There's only so much brain power, and it's not, you know, it's, it diminishes every week. So when I come up with something that's decent, I, you know, I have to use it no matter what. All right, we've got a uh, the wheelchair athlete. Very cool. Parallel. And I didn't even see it yet, George. Hold on. Oh. <laughs> How many people's dogs just, like, started going crazy? You know I'm not mad at you, right, OCD? He's, he's really pissed, Craig. I'm not. He's angry. All right. Seeger, man, this is the second break in a row, by the way, that we've gotten a regular rip card and a jumbo rip card. Two breaks in a row. Sapphire. Nine point five. <laughs> That's exactly what I was saying. On the dog from their cat. Alex Bregman. <laughs> Timmy fell down the well. Oh, Timmy. L Ray's dogs are going nuts. <laughs> I don't know, genre. We need to. Especially during the mucus uh, infused sounds. All right, Sonny Gray jersey for the Reds. Another jersey relic. Cincinnati and Robert Haya. Sonny Gray. Andy Pettit, my guy. Yankees. Jim Abbott. Red Barrel. Poor new people. Dark, dark Drips, you know, ask you if we had any select breaks. He's like, no, I don't want any part of this. No, he um, got scared away. He's like, God. Like, is this what you guys do? Not normally. Uh, John Smoltz. This is the break we should do at the National in front of everyone. Yeah, on stage with the microphone. I'd be really terrible. We should do that. I'd have to have a lot of prepared things. Like 17 answers for The tops people would be like. Yeah, this is how we do it. They're watching us. Oh, my God. Is this what we do? Let's uh, cancel uh, Alan Ginner. Uh -oh. 
All right, we have the uh, Praying Mantis, which is mighty lethal and cold-hearted, yes. by the way. Thank you, Lord, for giving me venom. They don't have venom. How are they lethal? They, like, mate with the other Praying Mantis, and they eat them. Oh, okay, well. Isn't that brutal? Okay. It's Wish I'd known that. Brutal. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Jalen's going to co-host with you, George. <laughs> All right. Kendrick. Nationals. I'll do the sprinkler. You can do the rest. What is that, slang for something? No, I'll do the sprinkler. He can do the rest of the sounds. Oh, oh. I thought you were talking about something else. All right. And uh, a cave. What George smells like. See the green kind of smoke coming out of it? Hmm. What is uh what does George smell like, Alex? Uh, that's correct. I'll take uh, farm animals for three hundred. It's not Alex anymore. It's, it's Aaron Rodgers. Aaron Rogers. now. Oh no. All right, we got a Kim for the Cardinals. Alan and Ginner back, and the Farmers coming to the party. Look at that fine fella. Wonder how much of a check I'll get from the government this year. Oh, that oh boo. Boo. What? Well, you need the farmers. You got to... I didn't say. I just said he was wondering how much his check oh, was going to be. That's a touchy subject. I wasn't, I wasn't oh. trying to add politics into the deal. You, you know. I feel really awkward right now. Wow. All right. We got uh, Chris Davis for the A's. Three jersey cards in this one. Oakland A's. George, Oakland. Uh, uh, that's Ryan with the A's. Ryan were. That's a nine for creativity on that one. Eight point six. Oh, they see they like the uh, on the edge, George. Here you go. On the edge, George. Again, there was no political. Uh, not, no commentary there. Just maybe it was how you said it. Maybe it was the words. We are far we are farmers. Bum da bum bum. No, look what he tied. He's put bum da bum. Bum da bum 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 bum. That's what they do. We are farmers. Bum da bum 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 bum. No, but he was using the first word there as a pun. Bum. Oh my gosh, you don't get it, dude. Yeah, that brain power kind of dissipates after a while. Nine for Brian. Uh, George doesn't get it. Uh, I gotta walk him through it later. All right, Javi Baez, box topper for that topper spot. Uh, Are you talking about what Brian eh said? Yeah, George, I'll explain it to you in detail when we go off the air so you can figure it out. I don't think so. That's what they do. The music plays that, but it goes on a little further. Maybe that's all he means. Farmersonly.com. Lou Bob. Anyone want to be an explainer? We're going to hire someone to call me explainer. Alan Ginnerback. Uh, the tractor coming to the party. Hey, I just can't stay on track. <laughs> what do you? Why is everybody from Brooklyn when you do it? Hey, yo! <laughs> why is it everybody from Brooklyn? Maybe, maybe, I figured they just focused on that as opposed to what was said. They're out in the field, but they're in Brooklyn, <laughs> middle of Brooklyn. Abraham Toro. Uh, Jeez, quartz. Give me some quartz. Everybody's from Brooklyn. Oh my! It's going downhill fast. Uh, not Perez, bad, not fast enough. <laughs> it's already, it's already downhill. Oh, there's still a whole cake, a whole box, and most of a box. This is fun, George. All right, this will be the non MLB, I believe. A uh, Tandron Mini.
She thinks it is, Brian. All right, we've got Rehod. Is that right? Rehod? Uh, no, three hits per box. Three hits. Which could be a rip card, um, a book, a printing plate, a relic. I think a mini numbered is maybe a hit as well. A frame, right? <clears throat> Yeah. Under the stairs. That's where George hides his uh, specialty magazines from Debbie. Right, George? I uh, know. <laughs> he didn't like that one, dude. Rate right, that one. He didn't like it. Boy, those are some really good things. I'm glad you. Aren't had... you glad you changed me up? You're getting me a little more creative? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Aren't you glad you yeah. did that? All right, uh, Lorenzo Kane, Brewers, and it's time to wake up El Ray's pets. Good stuff. Riyadh. All right, Ramon. It's George's middle name, and it's uh, his first name. Ramon Loriano for the A's, Bat Relic. You go Oakland again. Ryan. Ramon. Max Scherzer, Nationals. Red Barrel. My favorite color barrel. Border color. Which one, Carly? I lost track. Which one are we talking about? Hey, look, there are hands coming out of uh, George's trunk. Maybe his co-host Jalen in there. Hands coming out. Never mind. Oh, Lorenzo Kane. Carly's new boyfriend. Sorry, Adam. Uh, Ben Attendee. Adam's off of that soccer star, so it's all good. All right, we've got a Citadel and Stronghold, Ankara Castle. Let's learn, George. You ready to learn? Sure. All right. Ankara Castle was built in the 7th century by the Hittites, who desired a garrison around the city. Its walls and towers have subsequently housed Persian, Benzatine, Benzantine, Arab, and Ottoman civilizations, along with, more recently, Local art and music events. Did you know any of that, George? I, I thought benzene was a, like a chemical, not a. It was. They kept it there. They kept it in the Citadel and Stronghold. Uh. Too far. Jalen's involved oh, now. No. He's involved. Uh, Door, Bobby Door, Alan Ginner back, and there's a bale of hay in our presence. Hey, <laughs> I don't know, man. Three bales of hay is way too much. Well, you wanted a redemption. There you go. You wanted. A I redemption. got did one. Well, I didn't want to. I so you want one. exactly one more? I wanted one more. McNeil, Jeff McNeil. See, you could have said what Carly said. Garnet. Man, don't even rate that, guys. That's just that's brutal. Zero. <laughs> zero, not zero, like, zero. Not just a zero, but like seven zeros. Yeah. Eight, eight zeros. Simeon for the A's. Parallel. You want to see my needle? The answer would be no if it was George. Um, Aquino for the Reds. Aristides. Ooh, the elephant coming to the party on the mini. Oh, man. Oh! <laughs> Whoa. What was that? I don't know, man. Whoa, you is that a that banshee? <laughs> That's a banshee. I told you I was going to try any of them tonight. I didn't know there was an elephant. I don't remember getting that before. I wish we hadn't got it. <laughs> I wish we hadn't got it. Oh, a redemption. 
full size autograph. Uh, guys, <laughs> Google this for me. Google this one. Hugo Juice Tandron. Hugo Juice Tandron. I think we just got one of his mini cards. That's going to be non MLB. Stand by. The tattoo guy. Barber. He's a barber? Hugo Juice Tandrum, the official barber of the Miami Marlins. Would that make sense? Well, there you go. He's a barber. Jim what, Tomey, my guy. What do y'all think? Yeah, that's what Snout said. Non MLB spot. So we're, we're oh, okay. <laughs> All right. Verlander for the Astros. Yeah, non MLB and Marlins anyway. Neither one's MLB. Jay Lynn has both. All right. Is that Sean Green, I believe? Dodgers? It is. Old school. Yeah, Tag Guy was uh, Taft. Is that right? All right. Many of Segura for the Phillies. If I ever meet any of you guys in person, like at the Nationals, you better be ready to do an elephant. <laughs> Poor wording. You may, you need to be ready to make an elephant sound. All right, is your nickname the elephant or something? Oh, no. All right, uh, Loriano might get a little redemption here. Uh, the farmer is coming to the party, and he's really upset at the last comments. <laughs> Okay, I know I had my phone when I walked out of here. Where did I leave it? <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, oh, man. All right. Hosmer for the Padres. Alan Ginner back. Kappa. How long is it going to take you to do the last box? Eh, a long time. Like 15 minutes? Eh, about I'll an be hour. For 15 minutes. A couple hours. Mike Mussina, Hall of Famer, I guess. Orioles. Last bat. pack of box five. Oh, we got a frame. It's an exciting moment when you get a framed mini. Bat Relic of Big Poppy, David Ortiz. Congrats, uh, Red Sox. There you go, Boston. Jeff Lynn. Love that. All right, and we've got uh, Soroka for the Braves. And one box left. I'm going to be sorry to see it go, George. All right, and then you guys have some decisions on your rip cards. Um, be glad to do those. Uh, you can tell us at the end. We would have to verify with your zip code if you're going to rip them or not here on the live stream. That is totally up to you guys. All right, nice one here. This is Ronald Acuna Jr., Box topper spot did very well, obviously. All right, last box. Aren't you going to be sad to see it go, George? No. Ah. How many uh, animals do you think we have in each box? Uh, I think that this one's probably a hot box for animals. Oh, that'd be great. That'd just be great. All right, the swamp. George's laundry before it is washed. The swamp. That's a really bad drawing, too. I know. <laughs> George can do surgery on the card. Oh, no. Matt Chapman. 
Alan again are back for I the mean, ace. I could do it, but no. George has a steady hand like a fine plastic surgeon. No, All no, right. no, no. You can't do another one of the same thing. Hunter parallel. Oh, you can, George. Oh. The corn stalks have a conversation going on. Um, hold on. What's that guy's name? I can't believe I, I can't believe I can't. Kevin Costner? Y yeah, that's him. Hey, where's Kevin Costner? I can't believe I couldn't remember his name. <laughs> Sorry. Thanks. Negative eight. That's all right. I can live with a negative eight. Negative eight. I think if you put it all together, I come out with like Hello. a point one. Lou Gehrig mini. There you go. Yankees. It could be a negative point one. Uh, that was good. I like that one, Andrew. What? Where are my children? Ha, huh, corn. Children of the corn. Ha. Huh. All right. We got Diaz for the Marlins. Mm. Rookie parallel mini. Yeah, that would have been good, Andrew. I wish I'd said that. Got a Shane Bieber. Don't call me Justin. Cleveland. This has been a great six boxes. George Brett, hand-numbered mini. The Mike Trout rip. Rod Carew rip. We've had an auto of Walker Bueller. Just a really good break. Fire ants, George. <laughs> So they're biting each other. I think so. Okay. Fire ants. Oh. All right. We've got Pepe, a baseball pioneer. Is it Pepe? I think it's Pepe. Um, that's going to the non-MLB spot. Non-MLB. Maria Pepe. Aaron Nola. Somebody needs to look her up. Type into chat kind of what her uh, story is. <clears throat> All right, and we've got a Citadel and Stronghold Fort de Dalmont. Let's learn about history, George. The mightiest fort protecting Verdun in France, Fort de Dalmont, completed in the 1890s. Were you there when they finished it? Nope. Where were you? I was long gone. Okay. It was famously taken by the Germans for eight months in 1916. An interactive visitor tour includes a gun turret, barracks room, and cemetery. Wait, wait, wait. Interactive? Yeah. With a gun turret? Yeah. <laughs> See? That's fun, George. First girl to play Little League. Oh, that's cool. Or one of, I don't know. All right, Keston, quit looking at the cards ahead of time. All right, the farmer's coming back out to the field. He's looking out, and he's got something to say. I don't know. Somebody somebody give us one there. Um, what's all that smog around? That's <laughs> not smog. It's white. It looks like smog to me. What's all that smog around? <laughs> wow. That is, uh, yeah. Do you do investments for people? Uh, David Wright. Not much anymore. Mets. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> My brain power is gone. Look at all that smog around there. <laughs> Tommy Lasorda mini. My guy, Tommy well, why Lasorda. Why would they just paint part of a field? Why not show it off into the distance? Yeah, let's keep on going. Smog. <sighs> Mike Trout. Please be over. JT Rio Muto. We should get another six boxes and keep going. No. Not fair to the smog to rate that one. There you go. See, now I have a... Oh, no. I don't like tractors. Carlton Fisk. Parallel. I love there's a lot of farm going on here. Tractor. Uh uh I don't like being a tractor. I want to be a combine. <laughs> uh, we're having too much fun. 
How many people are watching this None. fiasco? None. For real. Uh, 63 and 13. Maybe 76. Tom Seaver. 76 disappointed individuals. That's right. Lapis. That's what people do at NASCAR if they're going really fast. 76 people that got up and walked away and left their computers on. All right, Anthony Rendon for the Angels. Mini. Shanghai Tower. Oh, we got a frame. Mini framed card. It is a relic. Clayton Kershaw. So we got a uh, Kershaw and a Bueller framed mini. We go Dodgers. Eric. <clears throat> Mark McGuire, Big Mac. Oakland. We are going to do a hit recap. Um, we're going to go ahead and rip. If somebody wants us to rip the rip cards, we'll do that before the recap. So we need to know pretty quick. So if you have the uh, rip card, um, Rod Carew, which I believe is Brian, or if you have the box topper spot, Daniel, let us know, are we shipping them to you unripped or are we ripping them now? And we need your decision. Uh, if you're ripping it now, we need your zip code as well. So guys, let us know. If we don't hear from you, we'll send it sealed. Christian Yelich, Brewers Parallel. Nah, I didn't find it, Snap. I'm sure that got pretty boring. A giraffe before we're off the uh, off the boxes here. Giraffe time. I uh, bet the, the air's pretty thin up here. Was that the air is pretty thin? Yeah. Up here. Up here. Why does he sound like that? Because uh, he didn't. Because he's not from New York. What is he a sissy? He could have been. Hey, the air is pretty thin up here. Daniel, uh, George will confirm your zip code. Daniel, Daniel's saying rip the trout. He's a courageous man. Brian's saying rip the uh, Angels card, Rod Carew. Wow. I'm never going to say that Daniel is not a courageous man. Noah Syndergaard? Brian said rip it, too. I know. Oh, man. Give him a show. I'll try to keep that uh, trout in a pretty, I mean, it's not going to be in good shape. I'll try to keep it intact where I can ship it to you where you're still going to have it. Under the stairs, where some of George's farm animals hide. All right, so we'll do the rip, and then we'll do the uh, recap. Kyle Lewis, rookie mini. And uh, El Rey's dog's probably asleep. Ooh, I'm going to top load this one. That's an Allen and Ginner back of a pretty good rookie. Go, George. That's a mini. And, George, it's dog time. <laughs> Where, where does this one go? Is it? No, you're just going to top load it. That's, that's just going to the team. It's not a hit. And we do have another hit. Last pack. Castillo for the Reds. Jersey car. There you go, Cincinnati and Robert. Last pack of applause from Joe. All right, we've got uh, Yastrzemski. A little Yaz there. And Pink Opal. All right, so we got... All right, and we'll try to get about half the base cards if we can, maybe a little over, um, out to you guys. The rest we donate to kids. And uh, I'm going to do some surgery here. I'm going to do my best, guys. Hold on. I got Daniels. Let me... I had the Brian's, but I, I lost it. George will confirm those zip codes. Yep, on both of them. Good to go on both? Yes. Let me clean this off. Curious pack residue. 
Yeah, I mean, I was kind of distracted that time I was looking at the zip code. Sorry, Robert, you're right. My dog was weak. All right, let me see. Uh, let me see one of the mini top loaders, if you would. Go ahead and top load it. Let me see one of the mini top oh, loaders, and then let me see the Rod Carew, if you would. Let me get a team bag, just a regular team bag. It's fine. Sm the smallest one. This is red. Though. All right. So here's Rod Carew. Thirty-four seventy-five. Good luck, Brian. No, eggs are in twenty nineteen, Carly. They don't have them in twenty twenty. That's the twenty nineteen case. It's holding the green screen up. I'm telling you. Let me see your uh, box cutter. Sharper. This is Brian's, right? This is Brian's. Good luck, sir. All right. I already know that you have an SP Mini. So you have a Mini you can only get out of the rip cards, and it's a uh, MLB Legend. way above it right <laughs> you never know It's like nobody's saying anything. <laughs> it's just quiet. Roberto Clemente. That's a little boom for Roberto Clemente. It is a great mini card. Fit him up there. I like it. Very nice. You can only get that from the rip cards. That mini is exclusive. So I'm going to put this. Here's kind of how we do it. I'm going to go ahead and top load this. That in the mini top loader. And we're going to try to at least conserve this rod crew as much as we can, man. Front of it still looks good. Kind of a work of art on these things on the front. It's kind of weird how both of these were uh, angels. All right, and so we'll put this in a team bag like this. So there will be no other team showing. So this will go to the Angels. George, you can post it, note it if you want. I'll do that. All right. Uh, now I'm getting a little nervous. This cutting here is uh, a 
A little bit more uh, scary. All right. Sure you don't want me to send it? Seal, it's your last chance, Trout owner. Last chance, Daniel. Last chance, my friend. Last chance to bail out. We've reached the uh, windmill in Back to the Future 3. We've, it's a point in no return. No, rip it. All right. Here we go. Let's see what we got. Good luck, sir. I'm going to try to conserve this because that's very cool. Even if you hang it up somewhere, it's a very cool picture. All right. This is a little more involved. Let's see. That goes that way. Okay, so there are just two rip points on these. That's right. I don't want to reveal it on camera, so I'm going to try to keep it where you guys can't see it. Oh, that didn't work. This is going to be an adventure in ripping. So this back of this is not cooperating. So this rip tab here is not really working. Can you pull it from the other way or does it just start on one side? And it starts on one side, but I'm going to try it from the other way. I have a little bit of a sneak peek. Don't I can't see one of them. Okay. Impressive. All right. Okay. It appears, which this is kind of unusual. Well, I don't want to tell you. That's going to spoil it. Just pull it off. Or not. I'll try to get these off in a straight line. Yeah, I am too. It, yeah, Chuck, it's supposed to be three. It's three. It's three. Oh, this makes sense. <laughs> That's cool. I'm glad you're enjoying it. Oh, I thought it was another number 17. That doesn't make sense, actually. All right, our first card, I'm going to take it out of here very carefully with the backing. I don't want to reveal what other, what's in the other ones. Stained glass, my guy, Reese Hoskins. Okay. Look how beautiful these are. Really cool. Man. Put a dummy card behind it, maybe, and see. Man, these are cool, like, to slab these, I think. They just look great. Reese Hoskins Mini. going to be the first one, which we don't need this backing on these. So, all right. And, George, I'll let you top load that. Have you hand them back to me here in a minute.
not sure who this is. We'll try to get this out without doing any more cutting. I'm going to have to do a little bit. Stained glass number two. Johnny Bench. Johnny Bench for the Reds. Ah, so cool. Different stained glass design on each one. So cool, man. That is cool. Love to have a set of these. I mean, I don't know how, how many there are. I'm sure there's a checklist. Johnny Bench. George and last but not least we have one more cut to make that'll be it Ooh, we have a rookie here All right, we are three for three stained glass cards. All th actually six for six in the last two breaks. All stained glass. This is Aristides Aquino. Wow. Rookie two uh, Cincinnati Reds in this one. There you go. Reese Hoskins, Johnny Bench, and Aristides Aquino still cannot get a mini auto. We have never gotten a mini auto out of any of our rip cards. They are hard to get, man. It's only 10 of each. All right, I'm going to close up your trout. It is pretty much destroyed on the back, but I think, I think you're pretty good on the front. Still looks really good. We'll still get that out to you. Yeah, you could frame that or something. Right? Yeah. Courageous man. Bust, rip that trout. That's a hard thing to say, man. You got uh, three good minis there. All right, that was fun. Uh, let's do a hit recap real quick. Both of those or just the sign back? Uh, no, just the, just the sign back. And we won't show the stained glass cards. I'll uh, hand those back to me. Those uh, three. Yeah. I'll put those over here with Trout. We'll kind of leave that off. Good night, Carly. Good night, Brian. Production error, a lot of stained glass. All right, guys, we're doing a recap of the hits in Allen and Ginner. Uh, we did have a rip card box topper that went to the box topper spot. It was a Mike Trout. We opened it. We had three mini stained glass cards, Aristides Aquino, uh, Johnny Bench, and Reese Hoskins. We also had a Rod Carew rip card single and uh, ripped it and got a uh, SP mini of Roberto Clemente. Uh, so here's our hits. Uh, George Brett hand-numbered. Many. There is that uh, Rod Carew rip card with the uh, uh, the mini Clemente. All right, we got Castillo for the Reds, Kershaw jersey for the Dodgers, Pepe non MLB spot, Ortiz for the Red Sox non MLB getting this redemption auto. That's for a barber. Yes, he's a barber. Uh, Ramon Laureano, Bat Relic A's. Reds, Sonny Gray jersey. Chris Davis for the A's, jersey card. Jeff McNeil, jersey for the Mets. 
Uh, Teft, tattoo artist, going to the non-MLB spot. Relic. Tanner Hudson for the Cardinals jersey. Walker Bueller, mini framed auto. Dodgers. Berrios jersey for the Twins. Baseball Brit to the non-MLB spot. Goldschmidt, bat relic. Cardinals. Uh, Almora Jr. for the Cubbies jersey. And uh, Austin Meadows for the Rays. So that was it. Uh, for this break, all mini card ship, all numbered card ship, uh, all parallels, all that good stuff, guys, all the hits. And then everyone gets one stack of base cards. One stack of base cards only. Uh, the base that we don't ship, uh, which will be some of it, we donate to kids. So we're going to stop the video here. It was a long break. Thanks for staying with us. We'll be right back to tell you about uh, Monday's lineup. Monday. Monday's lineup. Be right back. <laughs> 